<clears throat> What's up guys, this is me, Mario Sox Vlogs. Here are the Jurassic Park 1993 Kenner Coelophysis, also known as Sprinters. So, starting off with the green one, obviously. I know the paint ain't on mine ain't that gray like on the tail. For most of all, it's actually not that bad. The paint on mine. A little close up. Also here's the hands which do move a full 360. Really nice sculpt. Even though they are silophysis, I guess you could, you know, pretend that they're like compies. See like me out of full rubber. Which I, I think this is pretty obvious. These things are bendable. Reposable. Which is neat. But if you grab behind the tail, that's why there's paint. Watch. Move it. You move the tail side to side. There you go. So yeah, that's pretty neat. You know, gonna move it. And it's really neat how the different positions that you put them in. Like, for instance, I could like bend. Let me bend the body. Because there's like a wire that's running through the entire thing, so it's like all made up like rubber except for the legs and arms. Like say if I wanna like make it like this. I'll just like pose it. And see the entire, you know, just thing is. If I just make the head a little bit more straight. So yeah. So then it you know, you just bend it and yeah. There we go. It's really neat. I'm just trying to get rid of this. Really nice figure. Technically, you don't need the tail going down like that. I just used it for balancing and all that. Really neat figure. I personally like the green one. I don't know. The green one looks a lot more innocent. I don't know. Really nice figures. Personally, I really recommend picking these things up if you could find them at a decent price. If, you know, the paint job's good. Paint job's not that good, then I don't know. But yeah, yet again, same thing. You know, you move the tail. Sort of could have a, you know, session thing. Like it's a Thrasher T-Rex from Lost World. Sadly enough, though, his little thrashing action does not work. Because, you know, the wire's probably, uh, like, broken in here. But yeah, this one, yet again, he has wire. Might be curious why mine looks so different than other ones. Well, as a kid, I repainted it because the original um, paint got is gone. And that's why it looks so weird. Action. Sadly enough, the searching action does not work as well as on the ground. Like the green one, it works really nice, but um, on the gray one, though, it just doesn't. I don't know, it doesn't seem to work that effective. It's a lot more stiff. Real quick. There's actually something I forgot to mention with these guys. It might be a little familiar. Yep. This was the main way, reason why these were like posable. These were why these were made out of wire. It's just one problem though. I have no clue on how you're supposed to put these guys on the figure. I really have no clue. Like, he's about to fall. I, yeah, I, I do not know how to put these guys on the figure. So I'm just assuming that I was, like, that way. Besides that, I hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and tell me what you guys... Think of these figures in the comments below. Do you like them? Do you think they suck? Do you think they're stupid? Do you wish Mattel would make something like this? Tell me in the comments below. And what do you guys think? So yeah. See you guys later. And see you next time. Goodbye. Have a wonderful day.